excited because I get to craft with both of these Q-tips. Well, please welcome Q-tip. I bought some treats. Oh, what, what? <laughs> treats for, oh my gosh, we're gonna try something. Oh wait a minute, wait a minute. Oh, he's gonna love all this. Ah, ah. Now, what's, that what's his name? Monk. Monk. I named him after the hey, Monk. Monk. Oh, you did? Yeah, oh, because he looks like a piano. Oh, he's a beautiful. Think? Yeah, we have to pick that up. Oh yes. We got here. Let's put if that. Not, no, no. Will, no, oh, no, 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 no. That's part of that's part that's of what part you're of gonna ask thing? me. Yeah, because oh okay. Q-tip okay. wanted to know some tips about how to make the. Monk's coat a little prettier. Yes. Okay. Yes. How old is Monk? Monk is seven. Oh, seven. You're not a little tiny baby yet. No. Oh. No. And this is a Boston Terrier? Boston Terrier. And very friendly. Yeah. Very well, friendly. Yeah, he could be friendly. So, if food so, is in the equation, he turns Look to at him. Now, turn around, Monk. Come on, turn around, baby. Yeah. Monk, 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 has, Monk has a little bit of a thin coat. Yes. So Monk needs to have salmon. This is well, he loves cooked that. salmon. Now, it's a little expensive to get this, but ever, for a treat, it's very important. Okay. With, with a little bit of omega-3 fatty um, acids on it, okay? Mm -hmm. Now, mm -hmm. some reason this and is And that's close. good for the coat. This is it. so good. Yeah, a little bit of oil is mm -hmm. so good for animals' coats. Mm -hmm. So what do you think? What do you like that? Oh, yes. Mm -hmm. What have you been feeding your dog? <laughs> I'm not, I've been feeding him dog food. Oh, but he has to have but some omega-3 fatty acids. Well, and you're making me hungry with that. <laughs> this is really good. Now, what about sardines? Has he ever had a sardine no, in his life? No, he's well, never had a sardine. This is so... Oh, look. <laughs> hey, are you... Are, oh, you're not a cat. Oh, now, okay, that's enough because we don't want him, you know, throwing, <laughs> throwing up on us during the show. <laughs> and then, but this is very important, really? okay? So that's, that will help his coat so Aww. much. Yeah, he's a little bit dry. Yeah, little You're bit. a little dry. Sorry, yes. Puppy. Now, do you bathe him often? I do. I, yeah. I bathe him, like, uh, once every two weeks. And what maybe. kind of shampoo? Um, I try to use this organic thingy that I get Like Frederick from... Vickai shampoo? <laughs> Frederick who? What is that? Oh, no, that's my shampoo that I oh, use really? in my hair. <laughs> my dogs get, they get my shampoo, my conditioner. Well, maybe I can, maybe if it's good enough for them, it, it, for me, it's good enough for the dogs. Maybe I could get a vat of, of that. Here, oh, a vat. Okay, treats. well, we'll ask Frederick, okay? <laughs> <laughs> so great. So you have this, this is your second solo album in about nine years. Yes, it is. So, and you're, uh... And the first one, uh, very, very, very successful. Yeah. And you are really kind of a historic figure in the world of rap. Well, I don't know about historic, but I, I started out with a group called The Tribe Called Quest. Right. Yeah. You all know that, right? Uh, <laughs> there they are. Yeah, I started out with them um, And really, in revo really revolutionized rap well, in terms of the, the poetry, yeah, well, the subject matter. Well, at the time when we were coming out, it was interesting. There was uh, groups like Public Enemy and N.W.A. and Ice T, and uh, we came out in the middle of it, and we kind of embraced jazz, and we and we were talking about inclusiveness of all people in our music, and we was dealing with kind of like the grassroots of hip hop. Yeah. So we kind of stuck out like a sore thumb. What does the Q stand for in your in your name, and what does what does Q-tip mean for you? Well. It's, a, it's like one of these nick, nick, nicknames, you yeah. know. I, I wish I had like a funny, great story about what the <laughs> key, But it's actually like growing up in New York City, it's like just one of those like names that your friends give you as a kid. So I was really scrawny, and I guess because I was scrawny, I had a big so head. Now, who knows what scrawny so. means? Anybody in the audience know what scrawny means? Show of hands. Huh? Skinny. Skinny, okay. Yeah, I was... Oh, scrawny. Scrawny. Oh, I thought you said scrawny. I thought scrawny was a I'm new sorry. word. <laughs> scrawny, okay. Yeah. I, I know. know. Look, your dog but is so well behaved. Monk, hey, Monk. Monk, you can let him go. He'll just no, wander around the No, because no, he's, he's going to search everybody out for food. Oh. <laughs> He's fine. Well, anyway, we, uh, we thought because a, a play on your name, the mm -hmm, Q-tip, mm -hmm. the Q-tip, yes. we thought we'd make a Q-tip holder. That's good. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, do you like... I'm into it. Do you have, like, gold-plated Q-tips lying around? No, I don't. You don't? No. Well, maybe, maybe somebody will send you a gold-plated one, so I'll put in this <laughs> very special... Look at, this, look at this holder. Wouldn't you wow. like one of these? That, that would be look, nice. Look, full of Q-tips. 
And it's just the right size. Would you like to learn how to make that? Have yeah, you ever I done would. have you ever done any soldering? I have a little bit of soldering. Yeah. Oh you have? Yeah. Oh, so you you know how to do this. I okay, hope well, so. well this is glass you know how to cut glass? Well, a little bit, maybe. Yeah. <laughs> Why? Why do you know how to cut glass? <laughs> I want to get into that. <laughs> Did you well. ever? Yes. Okay. So you're you're using right you're right using up. gray glass, okay. and I'm using sort of a lavender glass. And oh, this glass is beautiful. A, a 12 by 12 piece of glass like this costs 10.95, and you'll need um, you'll actually need um, two pieces mm -hmm. to make this. Mm -hmm. So and so and you might as well get three pieces so that you can make two of the Q-chip holders. Okay. So we have our uh, glass ruler, we have our glass cutter, and we have our pliers to break the glass. Okay. Okay. So just the the, mar the just put the rail edge right on the blue. Okay. Right line it right up very straight. Okay. Mm -hmm. On the blue line, then take your glass cutter and you're going to be cutting. See that little cutter yeah. at the mm -hmm. right in there. Mm -hmm. Okay. So. You, they say to really draw it once, but you can draw it if you don't feel. Start at the very edge and then pull hard like that. Oh, you're good. I go twice. You're good too. I can hear it. Oh, per that one is perfect. Yeah. Okay. okay. So now take your little glass plier and okay. put the white line on the red line. Mm -hmm. Just like that. The white line on the red line. Yeah, and then just. Like that, see? And just like... <laughs> oh, it worked! Okay. <laughs> so, now that could, it could possibly not have worked, but yeah, it, it, it worked. Disastrous. So now this is, this is a very, this is called a scythe stone. And a so scythe you stone. scythe. Okay. And then you just... Scythe it. Yeah, you scythe it, so you smooth out that edge and you mm -hmm. get any rough, rough, little things off it because you don't want to cut yourself and you, you can do yeah. that to yours too on the cut edge yeah that's good thank you then we have to apply copper tape and this is 11.95 for a big roll of copper that's tape it? yeah that's all and it's very beautiful copper tape mm -hmm. and what we're going to do is completely that's good that's good yeah okay we're going to take the copper tape lay it down without oh, mine looks crooked it does yeah let me see. See? No, it's not so bad. Okay. No, it's not so bad. Don't tell anybody. Do you think mine's always straight? I just never believe it's straight. <laughs> I mean, all these craft projects I do, you know, half uh. of them are unacceptable. <laughs> oh, boy. And I'm sure my crafting department takes them back and look at this, they say. <laughs> she doesn't know what she's doing. Okay, so now you're going to lay this mm -hmm. evenly down the copper copper tape like okay. this we what we want to do is completely surround you have to do that too you oh, your, yeah no. I have mine yeah. okay so okay. then that and then you're just going to keep turning this and pulling the tape off don't pull too much off at one time because you'll okay you get uh, screwed up there and then this are you on a tour I am I just so came back from you? Australia <gasps> and Japan Australia did you have a good time yeah I did good reception Great reception. It, when we were there, there was the, not to bring it down, but there was the uh, brush fires. I don't know if you guys oh heard Oh my about gosh, that. yes. Yeah. Could you see the smoke everywhere? Well, when we went to, uh, to Melbourne, when we got off the plane, you immediately smelled oh, the smoke. Oh, such it a tragedy. So horrible. So many people died. Oh. People, animals, millions of animals. Oh, millions. Of, yeah, you know what? The, none of the newspapers really even talked about the animals. Yeah, it was so All the really kangaroos sad. and the, yeah. and the uh, sheep, everything. I mean, everything that's domesticated and wild, right? Yeah, it was very, very sad. Okay. But the people were festive and it was fun and very See? hot. Very hot? Yeah. It was about 40 Celsius. Oh, Do what's you guys that? know what that is? Is that about 100? <laughs> no, that was about like 82 degrees. That's not so hot. 85 degrees. That's like, like that. summer. Yeah. It, it is summer down there right yeah, now. It's, very, it's winter here, it's yeah. summer there. I'm going to Europe too. Oh, oh you are? When? I'm leaving uh, this weekend. I'm going to London and Paris oh, and Amsterdam. Oh, good. And, and big stadiums and big. Oh, big theaters? Nice, nice theaters. Oh, nice good. size theaters. Oh, wonderful. Well, good luck. Do you, uh, do you like Paris? I love Paris. Yeah. I love Paris. Nice. So see, look what we're doing. Yeah. Now cut that off with your, okay. you all the way around? Yeah. Cut that off with your scissor. And then take your little bone folder. This is mm -hmm. called a bone folder. 
and you smooth this out, because this is what you're going to actually solder. The copper wire is going to hold the whole thing together right. and give you this beautiful soldered edge, see? I see. And so we're going to do that when we come back, so don't go away. We're back with veteran rapper q -Dip. And before we continue crafting, let's hear some more from his latest album, The Renaissance. Okay, this song is called uh, Dance on Glass. Interestingly oh, very enough, appropriate. Very apropos. Um, and it's just about uh, the state of affairs and, and music and, like, it seems like, like the corporations want the artists to give music and give things that are easy to sell rather than things that emanate from their heart and their soul. You know what I mean? You're right. Just trying rapper, to stay. Rappers have, but rappers have consistently done their own thing. Yeah, but as of late, because it's been just so co-opted and become more yeah. popular, of course, yeah. you know, You'd you have to go kind more of mainstream. Like, yeah, a little bit, and it's just about you know not losing sight of who you are as an artist and trying to evolve and take your craft. Who's your publisher? I, my I publish my own. Oh, you do? Yeah. Oh, good. Well, yeah. congratulations. Yeah. So, now we have to finish making our Q-tip box, okay? Yes. So now we're into yes. the soldering, and you said you'd like to solder. I like solder. Okay, so this is, see, see what we did? We got a piece of wood okay. that is exactly the size of the, the glass and goes around and it's taped to it mm -hmm. like that. So now you have your little box mm -hmm. all secure. Okay. And now you have some flux, but if you took the tape off, it'll all fall apart. Right. Okay? Right. So now flux is the first thing you have to, it flux kind of cleans and preps the copper okay. um, tape for soldering. Okay. Okay. So you brush it. Right. Yeah, over the whole thing. Just it, it gets it ready to accept the solder. And what we're trying to do is seal that edge completely so that it looks, so it'll hold together. Okay. So, yeah, I, I did a lot of soldering when I was, like, young crafting with my, with my father. He loved to do crafts. So here's yeah. your little soldering iron. And I find that it's better to melt it on the soldering iron first and then just pull along okay. the tape. And it takes quite a bit, and you might go more than once. Oh, look at this guy's perfect. No, oh, you've done this before. Yeah, I like soldering. So, what do you are you plumbing, or what do you do that you uh, solder? Just stuff in my house. I yeah. see you do. You have a soldering iron. I do have a soldering. You have a toolbox. I do have a toolbox. Good. <laughs> so. I like my toolbox. My mom got me my toolbox. Oh, she did. Yes. That's great. So there. Okay, and then you just turn it over and you go and do the next side. And oh, this one came. This one came and then you came just keep a little bit. Keep flipping it, Mike. Yep, keep flipping, flipping it and uh, and doing the whole thing. And then you'll have your beautiful little box, which is over here. Mm -hmm. But it's not hard. Soldering is a lot of fun. And here it is. So we want to make sure that there's no little sharp edges for your furniture. So right. you have to put these little museum squares. Okay. On the bottom. On the bottom here. Huh? Yeah, they're like little baby easy glides. The little feet. Very, I like these things. Mm -hmm. I love putting things like this on my furniture so nothing gets scratched. Right. Well, there. this is good. Yeah. Well, I'm glad you played some of my album. Oh, yeah. Well, that yeah. sounds really good. Did you know that I, I put it out on, on November 4th on oh, you Election did? Day? Oh, yeah. Oh, that's good. And so you were celebrating that night, I hope. Yeah, I was. Well, uh. you know, the album is called The Renaissance, and I just felt that. You know that we kind of needed a renaissance. We definitely, that, you know? we definitely needed a renaissance, so. and now our our hero is having a hard time. He's, yeah, but he's uh, talking to us. Yes, and he's uh, um, certainly giving us hope in this very very difficult economic yeah. climate. So here, th now this is a patina. Okay, you can apply that with. Guess now what, what does this do? A Q-tip. Well, it makes it. Yeah. You can leave it silvery mm -hmm. to match your sneakers. I should have let you leave it. Show your okay. sneakers, to everybody. Look. Oh, oh, yes. Oh. <laughs> you like my sneakers? Those are my I big sneakers. I love his silver sneakers. You like those? But if you want to, this is just an antique finish. So I don't know why. I don't know why. Those I, are called Bates. 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 Baby Apes. B a p e s. B a p e s. And an s for plural. Yeah. Okay. And where'd you I got get it? them in Tokyo. Tokyo. Oh, they're, they're beautiful. Very, they're very good sneakers. I yeah, like them. they are cool. Yeah. 
I like them. I want a pair. You want a pair? Silver sneakers. <laughs> oh, boy. Oh, boy. Well, I want you to autograph one of these for me. You can, well. We'll make you as many as you want, but I want one I'm gonna for me. I'm going to autograph a box right okay. there for you. So every okay. time I turn on the tube and I start to view the Martha Stewart show, I'll see my box there. Okay. And then I know that you really do care. Okay. See? There's the pen. Okay. Okay. Is it going to stay here? You bet. Here, do the pink. Uh, don't, yeah, do the pink one. The pink one? Yeah, do the pink one. Okay. I'm going to sign it real jazzy so that every time I turn it on... It's going to be there. Uh-oh. I have to tell my stylist. Oh, look. Let me see how you write Q-tip. I'm going to do it on all, all, all sides. Oh, okay. <laughs> so we won't get confused here. We'll never, we'll never, never not know who made That's this That's right. <laughs> Be sure to pick up a copy of Q-Chip CD, The Renaissance. Everyone in the audience is going home with a copy. So, great cover, great back cover. We'll be right back. Oh, who took the picture?